welcome to Sharjah for match 13 of the DP World ILT20 featuring the Desert Vipers against the Sharjah Warriors coming to you live from the Sharjah International Cricket Stadium. Johnson Charles from St. Lucia, over 6,000 runs, strike rate 131. Combination, always have done, always will. I just felt maybe if they were going to change the top order, that's an excellent record opening the batting. This is a test. Shine Shah Freedy. First ball. Oh, that is a shocker. Shaheen, that is as bad as it gets. Oh, slip, slip, slip. It slipped out, Adam Hose. That's what you're there for to catch it. Shaheen with a wry smile. That's not good enough. That's out. That is out. Dick Weller knew it. Dick Weller is on the way back. Wood is gold. First two. Finally gets a little bit of glove, I think. Yeah, a little bit of glove. Nice catch, Azam Khan, because he would have been heading down leg side, expecting another wide. Oh, that was very risky. From Johnson Charles, it was a bit of a nothing shot. Not sure whether he intended this or whether... It's gone straight back over slip, straight into the hands of third man, and Shaheen takes a very good catch. It's like a firework display out there. I don't get the thought process of Johnson Charles. It's reckless. He's given his wicket away. He's in form. It's an excellent... Picks this one up. Whoa, that's a good shot. And don't forget that DP World donates a cricket kit for every six hit in every match. Feedback to Luke Wood. Pitch it up. Yeah, picking up length quickly. Clocked on the head early, but this is a wonderful shot. In front of square, that tells you that Tom Cole at Tirana. Still getting it wrong. Still getting it too straight. But the thing about his action is that... Such good timing from Martin Guttel. Just easing it away. Rasp. Dragging that from outside the off stump and into the road. That's the shorter boundary tonight as we've moved over to the other side of the square and it's been targeted. What an expensive start this is. Tom Cole Cadmo on underneath that bounce very impressively. Gotcha. Going straight. We've seen some runs off the bat of Martin Guptill straight. Now we'll see runs of Carla Cadmore's bat straight as well. One over for seven. Shot. Straight down the ground. Brings up the hundred. And Carla Cadmore's half century. That's his 34th half century in this format. 50 of only 26. And remember, he got hit on his head. He pops, long hops. Here we go again. Superb from Cola Cadmore. That's three sixes in this over. He was the leg break straighter, and he just went straight. 94 meters, the longest of the game so far, El. Wow, he has walloped this. It's six more, and the partnership of 101 from 53. And that too against one of the quickest bowler. It was a slow ball, I don't know why, because if you got pace, especially when you're getting hammered, there's no point uh, bowling variation to two set batters. Talented boy, inside out, straight in the fielder. They got the breakthrough. Look for it again. Yeah, it was a slightly slower delivery. How about that? How about that? Straight out of the ground. Is that going to be the DP World biggest six of the match? Probably, you're right. 
Look at this, middled it beautifully outside the stadium. 102 meters, the biggest of this match as well. That's not gone where he wants. A little bit of a skyer, but look what is very good underneath. Any catch, takes it safely. Big moment possibly in this game. Favourite leg side, it's back of a length, hard length from Shine Shafridi. It's a pace on delivery. Luke. The stumping works this time around. He knows he missed the easy one earlier, but he makes amends. Stays in the hands. Saranga invites Daniel Sams down the crease. Sams' second ball is faced, so adventurous. And another one, make that 147 for six. The last 30 balls, a 27 for three. Charger Warriors giving the game back to the Vipers. There's another one at the back of the hand, another googly. <laughs> oh, how good is Hasaranga at the moment? And this is absolutely falling apart for the Charger Warriors. The last six balls have brought about four wickets in one run. At the back of the hand, keep an eye, LBW. Yeah, it's plot. But the thought process should still be we've got reviews. It's a good effort. That is a good effort by the bat, not so sure about the fielding. Up in the air she goes. Who wants it? The bowler will take it. Shaheen will drop it. Well, Shaheen called for it. How well he hit it? Well enough to find the fielder. But Luke Watt drops it. She's down and the stumping gone. Swatted. That's the end of it. 20 overs. 174 for seven. Very good final over from uh, young Paterana. Just seven runs conceded. 174 for seven. Desert Vipers have been set 175 to try and register their second win of season two of DP. Nice start from Wokes, who's it's one of those bowlers who can bowl it just. Big side it is, and straight to the fielder. Johnson Charles takes a simple catch on the boundary. Middle leg delivery, generated extra bit of bounce. Didn't middle it straight to the fielder, Johnson Charles. Far. Back to delivery. This will race away to the boundary. It was right in the slot. Ten for one in two. He waited for that, did Hales, and waited perfectly. Look at this shot, picked up slow ball early. That's why he's so good in this format, Alex Hales. And maximum. How has he done that? He had to make a late adjustment and somehow has got really good bound. me his clip. Another shot. Oh, he's got the wicket. A breakthrough. What a over from him. One for four in five deliveries. Length. He was trying again. He's a shot to get it behind square on the leg side this time around. 5-5. Five, five. Cut, cut. Thick outside edge. Oh, just over. Thick Shanna. For a moment, it looked like the Sri Lankan might clutch it in one paw, but it skips away and hails. Ultra aggressive, gets back-to-back -back boundaries. Lovely game of cat and mouse here between Scotsman and Englishman. And it's the Englishman who's winning right now. Six. Six is certainly in contention. The DP World's biggest six of the match. Check two maximums and the sound of this good six from Alex Hales will give him a lot of confidence.
This is the second time that Mark Ward has actually come up into the attack. Blocked. Up and over the offside. I tell you, this is a good pitch. Really good surface to bat on now. Now, leading edge. Easy as you like. This game just keeps going one way, then the other. Captain takes a simple catch. Hasaranga has to trudge it off. Daniel Sams slowing down the ball. Change of pace offered to Hasaranga, who doesn't change his style of play at all. Oh my word, what a sound off a blade. Is there a nicer sound in the game of cricket? That is a beautiful Sky 247.net Super 4. You take the game deep, and ranma has gone now. Ron Mustafa slog sweep. He's got his first wicket, Lewis Gregory. And uh, breakthrough pressure on the Vipers now. For well, the confidence, and he tried to improvise, manufacture the stroke. Not quite sure. Didn't hold his shape really. Swung his bat around legs. Chips it, clips it for four. Now then, that'll give him instant confidence. Well, he's hit this well, so well, it's four. He was bowling much better when he was darting them in, what? And now that was a flighted delivery. Where's it gone? Where's this gone? Big! A big six. And don't forget, it doesn't change the size of the kit. But every six that is hit, it's a new set of kit towards grassroots cricket. That's a good shot. Look at this slow ball, he picked up beautifully. He's got a long average in T20, quite impressive. This is probably gone out of the ground. This really is. What a shot, and that brings up the 100 for Vipers. Game on here. In this match, Tikshana gets carted over mid-wicket. Wonderful from Alex Hales. How this possibly changes things for the Desert Vipers, we will find out. But it just makes this lineup look so much stronger when he is in form. 50, number 76 in his career. He has six centuries to go with that as well. <laughs> That's brilliant. That is wonderful from Hales. He's growing in confidence. A worry for the Sharjah Warriors. It's 113. Picks it up out towards the leg side and drop Johnson Charles. He's normally so safe on the boundary. It'll bring up the 50 partnership between these two and possibly, maybe, this game is slipping away now. The timing. Alex Hales probably thinks, yeah, I'm just going to lift it for six. Beautiful shot, really, but Johnson Charles makes a real massive strife upstairs. So it goes for width on the offside, and it doesn't matter in the end. Hales, after getting a life, very next ball is gone. Johnson Charles, you're lucky, because Lewis Gregory and Chris Wokes have bailed you out of hot water. Safe down in the deep, short, wide, pace on delivery of Chris Wokes. What an incredible shot by Azim Khan. How oh, has he hit that there? He had moved well across his stumps. It looked like he was shaping up leg side. And he said, no, I'm going to swat you straight. The, the position he gets in. Black back. Wonderful. Two feet almost off the ground, and a swivel. Slower from Sams. Clever, very clever. Rod Tucker says, yes, I think that's out. But let's have another look. So this will be sent to Leslie Reefer to have another look. Third up part television director. We have a player review for LBW. I've checked the border's feet, it's a fair delivery. Ball tracking when available, please.
hitting outside off, impact in line, wickets hitting, go back on field to Rod, or to stay with your out decision, you're on screen now. Didn't pick up the slower ball on that occasion, did Rutherford, in the end it will be his undoing. undoing. Last over for the Sri Lankan, one, one. Azam Khan has stroked this for four. What a delightful stroke that is. It's such a lovely time out of the cricket ball, Shadab Khan. Uh, correction, Azam. Hooray, no! I think he might be short. I think he might be short this time. It's Tom Cole, Cadmore, the fielder. They're going to have to go to the third umpire to see. That's well short of the line. I'm satisfied, ready to make my decision for the big screen. Outstanding piece of fielding by the... Over. No, but four will do. Nine required from one. Jawadulla, all he has to do is make sure that front or is it. Yes, it is. Well bowled, Jawadulla and Daniel Sams. Before, with the 19th over, Tom Kola Cadmore with a look of relief. The Warriors have won here in Sharjah over the Vipers by seven runs, a much-needed win.